Yeah. Alright man, what's it easy? Hey, zoom in, she's name is Trey Zoom. Big zoom in this thing, man. I just woke up. We play uh, Bowie State this week. So why not do a game day vlog? So, it's not actually game day. It's actually Friday, but we're gonna drive up to Bowie. We got about a six hour drive. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna just start right now. I'm gonna pack this bag. Uh, bus leave at 11, so we're gonna get some breakfast in this and then hit the road. I'm gonna vlog it for you. I'm just gonna take y'all through the packing process. Here go the travel bag. Got some uh, Livingstone attire. And the white, the light, the white. You feel me? We playing in the hurricane this week, man. Shout out Ian. Shout out Ian. All right, y'all. So we just packed this bag. Feel like we're pretty good to go. Yeah, man. We're good on that aspect. Let's go see what Molly on. Appears to be slightly asleep. Mm. Game day vlog pending, man. You're gonna have to get up. Mm -hmm. Bus leaves at 11. You should probably pack your bag. All right, facts, facts. All right, so uh, it's looking like it's that time, fellas. I'm gonna go ahead, and scrap it up, be ready to go. Hey man, say man. Yeah, we just finna get on the bus and everything. Uh, show you where we put our bags, and then we gonna introduce you to Silas and the guys, man. What's up? 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 Yeah, so we just got on the bus. <laughs> we getting ready to leave town, head to Maryland. Six hour ride, bro. You see the creek in the shades. Same day, long drive, five hours, I might, eight hours. I might change. Feel me, you day, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Feel me? Yeah. Feel me? Yeah. This is the only place we eat at when we on the So we eating in yeah, we just doing a little Golden Corral mukbang. Uh, this, this is where we eat at most times when we got road road trips. But uh, no, it ain't too bad. Nice and scrumptious. Fill you up real good. So yeah, enjoy. Are you ready, bro? All right. All right. Make sure you zoom in on your face, please. We eating our five star meal, you know. Golden Corral. Let me get you that feel me? Feel me. This nigga. Was I'm just telling the world what's going on. 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 We just doing the travel vlog. Travel vlog. Travel vlog. Game day. Listen, 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 Diamond, gold, and this shit. I don't know what to say. We know dunk like going to garage, don't they dunk? Not, not, not dunk. There you go. I don't need to eat sweet like that, but if Banana put that go to Korea, smack it, boy. Smack it, boy. That's another story. We ain't no storyteller, bro. We like two hours from my destination, bro. I'm ready to win, hey, hey, go back time, home, and ruin somebody's home. Time, home. Fast. We finna eat this later. Yeah, this we, nasty. Yeah, we eat it for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. All right, y'all, just got to the hotel in Baltimore. So we in Baltimore. We just touched down at the hotel. We're going to get these room keys. What it is, key talk to them. Me and Trey about to be roommates. We about to watch Jeffrey Dahmer. Nah, we're not doing that. And it's cash it coming in. Yo, hold on. You got it. Yo, this is 10 times. About better than what Gordon Corral is hollering about. You feel me? The cornbread tastes like cake. The hot. Hold on, let me give you a result of the hot. You feel me? Chicken and hot sauce. Okay. Tastes like Publix, bro. I ain't even gonna fly to you, bro. It tastes like Publix chicken, bro. Who made it? Whoever. Shout out whoever made it, bro. For real though. 
You just touched my soul with my heart, bro. Real deal. What up, Rod? Yo. Man, shout out my boy Shooters Touch Spiff, man. Glasses nigga around. I don't give a fuck what a nigga talking about. Brrr. Back up. <laughs> Him. Rice with the green. Back up. <laughs> Good? <laughs> Hey, you know, we just touched down. I don't even know where we are. We were somewhere in Maryland. It's Saturday. Psych. It's Friday. But I'm tired, bro. We've been on the bus. We've been on the bus for about um nine hours. Like, bro, we got on the bus at 11 a.m. I don't know if you can see it. It's a little blurry. But 9.06. But it's late. So we done ate and everything. We had a meeting and everything today. But, hey, we done had a long day. But, you know, we about to come out tomorrow. We're going to hopefully, you know, come out and have a great game. Come ahead. When I see you, I go go nuts. Please let me go, let me touch on the cocoa nuts. Let me get the milk for the cocoa puffs. Feeling kind of freaky, get the cocoa puffs. It was a dub. It was really a dub at this one. I ain't gonna lie. This one way better than the one we went to in Virginia last time. Back up, back up. Where'd you get the one? Look at this shit. Right. This shit, man. Hey. Go to cry. If y'all give me an NIL, I'll support y'all. Yo, <laughs> We arrive at the field, man. Bowie State's got a beautiful campus, one of the top in the CIAA, uh, one of the best teams in black college football, man. Amazing facilities. It was their homecoming. They put on a great show. Uh, you know, just wanted to get some, some B-roll footage for you guys and let you know this game may not have gone the best, but it was a road game. We are a young team. You know, I said this in the spring recap and the preseason pressure. Uh, but you know, Bowie State, Fayetteville State, some of the top guys, not only in CIAA, but in HBCU football, uh, competing against them is always an opportunity that you, you know, you really take honor in. Um, you know, playing against Bowie, they got an old group of guys, they got a very talented group of guys that have meshed together, and it makes you have to play football. You know, it makes you have to come together as a team. It makes you have to, you know, test who you are and see who you are in the heat of battle. So grateful thankful for that opportunity of course that number 21 that you see right there come across the screen and make a pick that's not just any old safety that's raymond boone you know these guys are nfl prospects these are some of the top guys uh in college football not only that but black college football so uh just an opportunity that you know I, i'm very i was very thankful for i was excited to be a part of um and you know the game didn't turn out the way we wanted but you know when you're a young team a young group of guys just getting together um, it's, it's pretty much, you know, just all about how you guys compete. And I'm proud of the guys. I'm proud of the way, you know, we play this day. We showed a lot of fight and we, we, we showed a lot of competition. And, you know, so being a part of that, like I said, blessed to even be there. I uh, had a great time and, you know, really was blessed for the opportunity to record for you guys and get some, some B-roll, some A-roll clips and, and put together this, this series just so that, you know, you guys could see what it was really like. Uh, as an HBCU football player and as a creator. Yeah, I mean, I was clearly frustrated, but I mean, at the end of the day, we took that L, man. And you, you really got to hate losing. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm not really cool with losing, you know what I'm saying? So... You know, you feel me? You see me? I was talking to my guy Manny. You know, just keeping the quarterbacks and everybody here in the game, trying to support everybody, cause it's all about competition. You know, and you know, I just don't like losing. <laughs> Didn't go the way we planned it. Didn't get the outcome we wanted, man. But you know, it's a blessing just to be here, man. I'm appreciative of you. Have opportunities. We still got the stone. 